Hey everybody, this is GliderCat, and it's time to play. We're back in Captain of Industry. Let's get to it. We've got a lingering water problem. We're waiting on research to try and solve it. We need pipes. I noticed that our research just ticked over. I don't think I want naphtha processing. I think I want... Oh, did that kill everything? It did. Do we need naphtha? I basically want to get to pipes. Um, electrolysis we need for wastewater treatment, right? Can I do wastewater treatment? Yeah, like, need electrolysis first, wastewater treatment, and then pipes. This is what we need. We need pipes desperate. Desperately. Let me just pick one more. Because once we get pipes, we're probably going to forget about everything else. Do the ship bridge. Maybe we can get that thing sent out. In the meantime, we were looking at um, a couple things. We were reworking our whole oil processing area to take advantage of the higher level storages. We're done with the crude oil because we'll be able to upgrade these again, I think. Let's just take a look at that. I'm pretty sure there's like a super duper storage. See if I can spot it. Yeah, over here, that's going to store. 4,320 units each. <laughs> right now we've got 2160, two of them. So I think this will be the final, you know, area where we got to take stuff down in order to rework it. Um, we could speed this up, couldn't we? Um, not much. We'll wait for that to drain out. In the meantime, we were talking about um, producing fertilizer and potentially getting limestone down here. Where do we want to do that? Let me just see if we if we wanted to put more fields down here, farm fields. Let's just see what the footprint like that would look like. We don't need to. We can have the salby production and maybe do more farming over this area as it fills in. Um, but let's just see what that would look like. Um, we could do one there, or we could go sideways and probably get two more in this area this copper stuff can be moved although you know this copper mine is probably we're probably going to want to extend it off to the uh the west here that means this farm's probably going to go away while we mine out the rest of that copper hmm so maybe I'm looking at this because I want to know where we're going to do our fertilizer production. That's kind of why I'm doing this. I'm thinking we might be able to get another cargo dock here for something. So this area is up for grabs, and then this area is kind of up for grabs. And all of this pipe and belts, that's fair game to be moved to left, right, wherever we want it. But let's just, again, see where these farms might fit. And I'm thinking we might just put two more in this area. Eventually, we could actually start with one, but that's not going to leave us much factory room, is it? We could probably get rid of that ramp. And then we got to route our production around this corner, too. Boy, we could use some fill, right? The uh, biomass into compost is not exactly churning out tons of compost is it it's kind of slow that would have been a possible source we could route this slag across at some point if we wanted to fill in this area a bit i think i actually putting a farm down here do we need vehicles to travel through doesn't look like anybody hardly does Yeah, we're going to see the limits of our bus here, our little collection of pipes, trying to get fertilizer and stuff routed into all these places. Hmm. If we did that, then we'd pretty much have to do fertilizer production off to the far, far west. And then potentially move all those pipes. We also want storage for diesel or for, yeah, for diesel. 
Uh, I guess those four tanks will be a plenty. One, two, three, four, yeah. Uh, trucking going right through the between those two fields. Let's build this and pause it. It's just kind of a placeholder. And let's see if we can make fertilizer production work over here somewhere. It's just if we want to scale up oil processing, say we wanted to double this, we're not going to really have much room to do that. I suppose we could take advantage of this little corner. It's just, I think, long term, this cargo dock is going to get double the size. Oh, man. Probably thinking too far ahead. We should just do something and we can always tear it up later. All right. What do we need for fertilizer? We need... Let's take a look at the recipes here again. So for basic fertilizer, ammonia and oxygen. We're going to use the ammonia we get out of here our sour water stripper, and that's going to be our limiting factor for a while. And then oxygen, we need um, an air separator. And then after that, we're going to need to put down, it looks like that's a mixer, right? Just a mixer to take the fertilizer, limestone, and again, the sulfur byproduct coming out of here. We'll get 42 fertilizer, and we'll somehow find a way to pipe it through this mess. We have to move pipes. We have to move all the pipes. We'll move them. So there's not a whole lot of infrastructure to actually do this. Um, it does look like we have a little bit of a road here, though. We don't want to impede on too much. So maybe... Maybe up this way. Let's get our air separator. I'm not sure where that one is. Sour water, where are you, air separator? That's going to be our oxygen. Let's go, let's do this in planning mode. We're going to, we, we may have issues with diesel, with our boiler running out of water, this one here. So we'll kind of keep an eye on that as we play. Uh, planning mode. Flip this. Flip. Oxygen, and then we need a mixer. This is going to take limestone. I'm trying to think of where to place these things. Limestone, regular fertilizer. And sulfur, right? Out comes the fertilizer. can come down. Ammonia. Let's maybe tuck this stuff into here is what I'm thinking. And we might be able to do it just right here. A small little fertilizer production will run. We already have the sulfur routed. We can pipe the ammonia through underneath this ramp, which we may not even need long term. Um, so then we do have the oxygen and the ammonia to make the basic fertilizer. And then just pipe that down to this guy, the mixer. And then the mixer can take his output and kind of run a pipe along here somehow and tap into these fertilizer tanks. And maybe we even have a tank or something. Although I, I'm sure we're going to burn through it like crazy. I don't. Maybe we don't need a tank. Um, but let's move this down. And let's take that air separator and see if we can tuck that in here. Um, we want room to 
let the ammonia through. And I need room to vent out that nitrogen. Ooh, it's a little cramped. We do it like this, maybe. How about like that? And then um, smokestack. Nitrogen goes up in the sky. I don't think we pay a penalty for that. How much are you going to put out? 36. So we better use a big one in case I want to boost. Ugh. I hate doing that. Seems like a waste. But um, these aren't terribly expensive, are they? No. And I don't think they take people or anything. Just in case we end up boosting that. Okay, oxygen. We need to get the ammonia routed. That's probably being burned. And do we need a pipe balancer here? We might. We might. We might. Um, too bad that is piped the way it is. It's going to have to come out. It's going to have to come out. Let's put our pipe balancer down. Like a so. I think that's fine. Boom. Ammonia comes in. This, even if we boost it, it's never going to exceed what one little pipe will do. Can I not connect? Looks like they're going to make us take this down. Uh, this guy can go too. Our sour water stripping is going to be on hold. Quick remove and quick remove. Pipe. Um, I'm going to get out of planning mode for this little portion because I think this is going to be fairly straightforward. Okay, ammonia comes in. And ammonia goes out. Regular smokestack here. Uh, could go right there, probably, right? Boom. Takes everything. I think that... Is that guy hooked in or not? Nope. You gotta be kidding me. Click the wrong thing. The elite. Smokestack. Line this thing up the correct way this time. Doesn't like it. Why don't you like it? Why don't you like it? Cancel that. Smokestack. Do you need a pipe? Oh, yeah, because this pipe thing won't hook up to buildings directly. Don't like it. Don't like it. That's fine. This is going to not be our priority out. Our priority out is going to be... Oh, boy. Did I just block trucking? No. Trucking can get through over this way. So let's do... Thinking about where our ammonia pipe is going to go through all this mess. Let's bring it... We said this is never going to have enough, right? Yeah. To be a problem. So we can use little pipes, I mean. This is going to be our priority out. want to come up. We don't want to connect anything. And let's do our little weaving job here. Maybe under the sulfur makes sense. Can you make your way all the way over there? Not quite. Got a bit of a problem. A little congestion here. But I'll take that. Take that. All the way over here. And then we're going to have to dip down and find a place to get out of here. Let's see if we can match pillars. A little. Going to have to start coming down, buddy. Find 
your way through here. Um, I'm okay with this. Just leave that pipe right there. Okay, oxygen and ammonia. And what is that made inside of? That's a chemical plant. Oh man, that thing's big, I think. Where might you be? Uh, it's not horribly big. Bigger than I want it. That's okay. Um, what are you doing? Nitrogen and oxygen, no exhaust to worry about, just two inputs. And fertilizer comes out. There's nitrogen and oxygen, and there's fertilizer at the bottom. I think that was a good spot. Yeah, I think that lines up, right? Yeah. That'll do. Oxygen, I guess if we doubled it up, we'd want a better pipe. So let's go big on that oxygen pipe. Can you really go anywhere? Or do you need to be on these specific ones? Looks like it's might have to have it here, right? Does that seem strange? As to me. All right, hydrogen, or I'm sorry, ammonia can come through this way. Let's uh, allow this guy to connect up. Okay, that is that set up. Now we've got, let's pick a recipe for basic fertilizer. Okay, we want our priority output to be this guy. So this guy runs, puts out some ammonia. If there's room, it sends it to turn into fertilizer. If there isn't room, it dumps into the air. We have problems right now with sulfur's backed up. That's why we're dumping sour water. Okay, this thing can go. Now we just need a mixer and I think we're almost there. Mixers aren't very big. Where might they be? Mixer. This is going to take fertilizer, limestone, and sulfur. Yeah, we got to get the limestone over here. That's what's going to be... That's going to be a little bit of a bear. A bear! But we can make it happen. Fertilizer. Fertilizer, fertilizer, fertilizer. Looks like... You want your limestone there, huh? That's our outputs. That's an input for fertile, a regular fertilizer. I think that'll do. Um... <laughs> Man, we're really encroaching on our roads. We may have to get fairly cozy here. Let's see if I can actually connect this up. Uh, you don't need water too, right? You just need, yeah. Oh man, it's a little snugger than I would like. I mean, we could move it and take up a bunch more space, but this is gonna be fairly compact. Okay, now we need to get Sulfur in here. That should be easy. We'll just branch off of this little guy with a U-shaped conveyor. In fact, yeah, that's probably fine. Boom. And now the challenge is limestone. Limestone, limestone, limestone. And I think, yeah, we want to connect up. 
<laughs> it's buried. We'll move belts around if we have to to, make, to accommodate this. But this coal belt right there is going to turn into a limestone belt. Um, and we need to connect to it here. Somewhere around here. So the corner near the farm field here, right? So this farm field, somewhere that corner is where we want to hook in. And then we'll delete the coal belt. Um, the coal belt could end actually right here. This is the last place it's used. All that could come out later if we want. Okay. Uh, in fact, if we want to, we could run limestone cleverly underneath and here if we want like underneath all this mess boom 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 even if it's on the ground we don't have any trucking going through here so this could be an avenue for limestone now where is limestone we saw it it's a little ways away it ends right there uh, we're using it to make paper that's as far as it comes over so we need to route from there to over here somewhere, right? We got two options. We could come down and hug the water line and try and have that become like a main bus kind of situation. Or we could hug the existing factories with that belt. Kind of thinking or we could do a compromise and kind of come down here and then come across as best we can and make our way over this way. Let's just uh let's just dive in to it. Yeah, let's dive into it. Uh we know what we need to do kind of or where we need to end up. U-shaped conveyor um we're never going to need how much are we going to need? I think we can just use level one conveyors, actually. Pick a recipe on this guy. Yes, six for every 60 seconds. We can always upgrade it later if there's a problem. What do I have here? Just a regular U-shaped conveyor. Yeah. All right. We may block trucking. I think trucking is probably already blocked through here, though. All, so, all simple problems to solve if we do have, if we are blocking trucking or something. That's not hard to fix. So let's want to wiggle or just come straight on down and get to business here. Let's come straight down and get to business. Uh, we can go high with this one, I think. Boom. And let's see if we can try to match pillars somehow. We're going to be hopping over things. May not be super pretty. Okay, our goal is to get somewhere in this area. So we can keep coming straight across if they let us. We might have to take this weird detour. In fact, it looks like there's a path. This way, I'm going to try to remember to pay attention to my pillars. We have plenty of room for trucking here. I'm going to have to hop a belt. Oh, that's kind of nice. It's kind of nice. Kind of nice. I'll take that. What are they going to give me? This? I'll take it. I'm probably killing, destroying trucking over in this area, but I think once we're in the pocket where the end of the belt is right now, there's no trucking going on, so I don't think it's too big of an issue. 
Um, let's park there. <laughs> and then bring, the, bring this down. Ground level. In fact, I could go ground level under that coal belt. That might be even better. Let's see how low I can get. Take it. Don't care. There's no pillars when we're on the ground. Okay, and we said we can connect up to the coal. Anywhere over here. Oh, I don't think I'm going to be able to make this climb. Uh, let's... See what we can you know what we might have to snake around like one of these deals and then we want to hook on to that right there I think we did it I think we may have done it okay we're gonna want to empty this belt And we want to delete this belt from there. Um, I'm going to go to there. That goes. That was the coal supply. This guy we have on order to be removed. Can't speed up that process. So this is going to be... Yeah, removed all the coal, be emptied from that belt. And that is now going to be limestone coming in. And so we won't need coal through here. In fact, they're doing the emptying. And they're doing a good job right now, emptying it out. I think this guy goes bye-bye. All this goes bye-bye. We can always put this back if we need to. Got a truck stuck. Let's just, um, let's just un whatever, recover him. Okay, all of this can go. We're going to take a little bit of, well, no, let's route this last little piece. We're almost done. Um, but I need this emptied. That needs to be requested. That needs to be emptied too. While we're waiting on that, let's, uh, take care of our diesel situation here. This is coming out. I'm going to go in. And so I need to feed this pipe, right? This is our diesel going out to everybody. I think, I think, I think. These all go. Let's take these out. Diesel coming into storage. Oh man. Got to figure out what we were doing here. This was temporary, right? This little pipe. Diesel comes out. Diesel comes out. This is where it joins up. Both outputs join up here. And then this is actually the supply pipe way up here. That's fine. This bottom one we could get rid of. Um, this is... Oh, 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 no. Oh, man, yeah, this is funky. I got kind of a loop. This is diesel going back out to where it's needed, but then it kind of has an opportunity to loop back. That's... I don't like it. Don't like it. It's this one right here I don't like. So let's get rid of it. And let's change this pipe to... Let's have this guy join up later. Yeah, after that. Basically over here. And... Yep. And then I think I want this section gone. I 
think so let's trace this through diesel comes out here diesel comes out here joins into this pipe right there's no going this way you have to go through storage oh, I see now I had this here maybe we don't need that that can stay that can stay if there's room downstream go ahead and feed downstream if not or just take half of it and force it to go feed the shipyard so that always has fuel and feed large storages a big old big huge array of large storages um we got a mess here that's got to be cleaned up that's supply coming in so these pipes need to go let's get rid of this stuff we're gonna redo these And then we'll get back to routing that limestone for our fertilizer production. One and two, and then route fertilizer. But let's get this done now. Quick remove. All that goes out. We need two more giant storages. Um, yeah, two more giant storages. I could just copy that, I suppose. Yep, yep, yep. Hold on, hold on, hold up. Let's get rid of this. That is the output going back to consumers of diesel. That is piping into storage. So that, I think, looks good. Boom. Boom. Let's go ahead and set these to diesel. Diesel for you and diesel for you. Now let's get these pipes routed. We can probably get by with just two. Oh yeah, this is a temporary pipe. This goes away. This goes away. We could keep it. It's kind of a short circuit to feeding here. Um, Let's not keep it. Could. It could actually be a little more efficient to do it that way, that way but it's just kind of goofy looking to me. Pipes. We're just going to route two of these guys. Unity is looking good. We're actually in the positive on that. Salt production is being researched. Man, we got a bunch left to do on research. Hopefully that's needed. We just checked that research. Trucking's extremely busy. Okay, why do you not want to connect? Because I have that on. Is this guy hooked up? I hope so. I don't see a little not connected symbol. Diesel comes in, makes its way through. Probably want to quick deliver some of this. How are we doing on parts 90? Uh, we're going to come up short on construction part threes. Can we get by? Yes, we can. Let's get rid of this because we have a bunch in these tanks. So we got ourselves a little bit of time. Here's our output going towards production. Boom. That one should probably be speedy built. Is that connected? It's not connected. Let's fix it. Every time I say let's fix it, I think of satisfactory for some reason. Okay, let's give that a quick build. We should be good. I think we're good. Boiler seems to still be doing its thing. Although I'm sure that water pipe, let's check the water pipe. I'm sure it's like empty. Yeah, it is. <laughs> oh man, hopefully we can limp along. Hopefully we can limp along. There's a chance 
If this guy fills up, yeah, that we might be able to squeeze by. We might be, we might be able to do it. We're running these both on a boost just to keep up. That is nice and supplied. This is our guy right here that's starved out of water. Let's check um, this side over here. This guy's going okay. I think we're okay. How are these guys doing? Are they backed up? Yeah, they cannot put more water on the network. Which kind of stinks. I think it's just throughput. I believe it's just a throughput issue. We could do kind of a cheaty thing and have this one of these water wells at least fill in up here. That would get more water kind of on the network, I guess. I think. I don't think it would really help, though. Because once this filled up, we'd just be backed up again. We'll wait for the upgrade. Okay, back to routing our limestone. Let's see where that's at. Okay, there's our limestone there. It's not moving, so this must not be connected. Or something's not quite right. Can we see where the problem is? Not really. That belt looks like it's going in the right direction. Um, are we, we're just not connected here. I think. I think, I think that's our issue right here, right? Why does this one look different? This is a level two. This guy is not connected there. Shoot. Let's delete that. Escape, escape. Okay, that's gone. Let's see if we can get these connected and if it'll work for us. We're gonna go just level one conveyor. Quick deliver that guy. Again, Unity's looking great. Trucking's a problem. Our population is slowly increasing. That's good to see. Oh, what is it? What is it? Why are you not moving? Oh, oh. No. Hmm. Not connected. U-shaped conveyor to U-shaped conveyor. You saw me do it. They were happy. What's the problem? There might still be a little bit of coal somewhere. Or the end isn't registering as being connected. Okay, let's follow this line through. Boom, boom, boom. Looks empty. Looks nice and empty. Okay, yeah, we're not hooked up, so it doesn't want to put product on that segment unless it knows it's going to get used. So let's, um, that's an easy solution. Let's fix it. Or complete this work, actually. You, 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 where are you going to go? This mess. Can you find your way across? Probably not. Um, we have a lot of pipes in the way. I don't, I don't actually see a good path through here. We could... Yeah, we're going to have to... Oh, man. I was thinking we could go along the ground there, but even that's a little bit of a an issue, and I can't... If I, Once I get under this pipe, I'm not going to be able to get out from underneath that pipe. That pipe could move over, though. Still going to have an issue getting out from that pipe. Unless... Oh, man. Yeah, this is a... Uh, not good. This pipe is our problem. What if I try and jump up a little bit earlier? Could be a solution. Let's try it. To you. You. Up. Does that give me a path? Um, if not, we could always hop that up too. I think, think this might work.
Don't want that goopiness. You can you can weasel in there, buddy. Right through here. Right through here. And now we'll get on the ground. Or do that. Bear with me. Well, you're just one high. Can you not dip down here? Can't. Can't do it. There's no room for him to go down. Um, maybe this guy has to come up. Let's try it. Can't connect to those apparently. Uh, maybe I just need to do this. Just temporary. Let's see if that gives my limestone belt room to make it through. Yeah, in fact, we can hug on top of here, although we kind of want to be... Mm. <laughs> I don't know, here. We need to get in here. That's horrible. That's no better. That's what I wanted. Let's... We got plenty of unity. We got all the parts. Let's quick deliver that. 1,200 construction part 2s. 763 construction part 1s. Are we replenishing construction part 1s? Curious. Not a huge deal, I guess. Or is that all I have here? Yeah. I guess that's our storage. This cannot be upgraded, right? Nope, nope. It's all fine. Water still an issue. Okay, we should see limestone on that belt. The belt is moving. That's a good sign. Limestone, are you on your way? There it is. Um, this is a faster section of belt than the belt that we have feeding. That's fine. I think it's going to be more than enough limestone. I like it. I like it. I like it. Check out our iron mine. They dug out that whole area. It's looking pretty good. They're probably going to be screaming for something. Fuel station is out of fuel. Hmm. Hmm. Which one? This one. Uh, maybe because it's not hooked up. Got about that. Um, can it just come from here? Can. Or it could come from here. Does it make any difference? It does make a difference. Let's do it from here. I think it does make a difference, actually. Where we pull this from. Uh, will they let me pull from there? Nope. That's what we want. He's getting some. Yep, yep, yep. Splits, half of it goes into storage, and then half's gonna come here. Then these guys split again, half goes into feeding the ship, and half will go into feeding this 
um, fuel depot or fuel station. This guy must be filling up. I think we're okay. Yeah, and diesel now is hesitating because we don't have water for our boiler. It's... Uh, take it back. We have plenty of high-pressure steam. Did I not route the high-pressure steam? Water. High-pressure steam. What's going on with these guys? Light oil is full. <laughs> oh, no. No, 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 no. Uh, we got to unpause that thing. I don't use planning mode because I forget. Okay. Or one of the reasons, one of the many reasons I tend not to use planning mode. Uh, what else? What else? What else? Where's my light oil? It's supposed to be cracking. We've got too much steam. And so now we're in a deadlock situation because I don't have a way to flare off excess light oil, right? That's my bad. And I don't have a good place to do that, do I? I don't. Except for right here. Right here. There's my light oil coming in. And this is backed up. How is that possible? I thought we barely were producing enough steam to keep this whole operation running. Medium oil. This guy's backed up on medium oil. <gasps> oh. Wait a second. Feels like I took a flare out that I needed to keep. Also curious. Yes, yeah, something's wrong. Sour water, that's all routed the way it needs to go, so that's fine. This little nub is nothing. Let's get that out of there. Distraction. This is our medium oil coming out. Boom, boom. Comes in, feeds these two. They process medium oil. Boom and boom. They're backed up because they can't get rid of their light oil. So light oil is the problem. Um, before we feed it into our boiler, we just want to investigate it with a pipe balancer or something. So let's do that. Uh, it's not a big deal, I don't think. Let's get the pipe balancer down first. It actually just kicked on, but that's all right. We'll figure this out. Boom. You into here. I don't care how you get there. You go away. Quickly. You go in here. I don't care how you get there. You are the priority out. Flare. Guess we can. Yeah, I can't snap it on because it only uses pipes. It's fine. Um, it's one pipe. Just use the big one. I don't care. And that flares out as the low priority. Let's quick deliver all of this. That should get our diesel production going. Like I said, I don't know how we got into an overflow situation on light oil, but maybe it was. Maybe that calculation was just barely had a little bit of surplus light oil that needs to be burned off. Apparently that's the case. Kind of surprised, but that's fine. Problem solved. Plenty of diesel coming in. We should be good over here. 
Lots of crude stored up. Lots of diesel to produce and a good amount of diesel stored up. Water. Little problem. <laughs> it's it's going to be a problem until we see that full. Uh, this section of pipe. Got a little more than it did before. Maybe that's climbing now? Slowly. Either way, it looks like we're going to get by on diesel. Knock on wood. Um, do I have rubber being produced at all? Or are we totally starved out? I've got a little bit of rubber. So that's consuming diesel. And that guy's got a bunch of storage. So we can... Pause the belt coming out of here. Boom. This is just rubber meant for trading to sell, basically. Uh, we've been trading it for wood just until we get our tree farm going. That's on the list. Things we need to do. We still have 5,700 logs here. Okay, these guys are producing away. Hopefully we'll see these storages fill up. What's next? What's next? We want to see fertilizer, right? And we got to route it too. Is there limestone making its way over here? It is. Okay, last thing we got to do. There we go. We got fertilizer too. It's loaded. We need to get this into our farms. And how we do that without blocking roads is, is a mystery. Don't know that that's even going to be possible. You're going to put out 42. Let's use the big pipes. And yeah, this is going to be tricky. I guess I can come in under the fuel line. Still going to have to wiggle, right? I can't cross our water line. Should I come in? Maybe here? Is this a path that we can take? We're going to run into something. Um, can I go above you? I can. Let's try that. Um, don't think we need to worry about pillars at this point. Nothing's getting through. Uh, I would love if you could hop over again. Just like that. Perfect. Stop there. Um, I'm going to stop here. I just want to see if I'm going to be able to connect this. You into you. Looks like it's going to be happy. Cool. Delete this little nugget. We get one less pillar. What's going on? What's going on? Escape, escape. Just want to delete that guy. I gotta click it twice. Pipe. Up high. Should be able to ride this other pipe. That's a water line underneath there, I think. Okay, we want to hop, come down quick, and then keep on trucking. Try to match pillars the best we can here. This one looks like it's going to be tougher. Um, let's put you right there. Oh, 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 I think I messed myself up. Yeah, I can't connect to that. Turn it. Gotta pull this back. I think it's gonna work. We just need to come down sooner. Ah. Select that one. Good. We're gonna get an extra pillar here that we don't need. That one I don't really care about. I'm gonna leave it. So hop me over here, fellas. Come down there, and then nice straight section here. Uh, 
You into there, and did I do this one? I don't think so. You into there? Okay, those guys all have fertilizer. Uh, we're getting by on three fields. Wow. And there's upgrades to come on those, too. I think we're getting by, right? Our food looks like... Crazy? Crazy good. I guess eventually, what will we do? Pull these back and make them super large or something? What do those look like? They're huge, right? The storages. Uh, unit storage three. Kind of have to do it. At some point. A little crazy. But yeah. Why not? Um, these ones are going to be a little harder, right? We can't really nest these, so maybe we give up. We give up one of these rows. We'll have to think about it. We'll have to think about it. It could be we run, say, the vegetables or whatever up the side here, and then into a big row of just the huge storages. And then the potatoes, same kind of thing, come up the side in just one straight run of big storages or something. It's not urgent. We have plenty of storage. It's just something to think about for later. Not urgent at all. Okay, I want to see fertilizer get used. And then do I have to do anything special in my greenhouses to actually leverage that? I'd like to see it in the pipe. Do we have any? Let's see what happens. Yeah, it's on the pipe. It's in the pipe. We've got a little bit in the tank here. So what do I have to do? Fertility needed, zero. Natural replenish. Fertility equilibrium is 65. So do I just crank this thing up? Not sure. I may need to look into this a little bit. Fertilizer overview. That's going to control how much, right? How much fertilizer is used. I believe. Fertility needed 4.5%. Let's see what it says here. Amount of stored. Whoops. Water. What? Oh, I was thinking that was fertilizer. Here it is. Fertilizer overview. Fertilizer can be used to artificially increase soil fertility above its natural equilibrium. Some fertilizers can even raise the soil fertility above 100%. Use the green slider to set the desired fertilization target. Fertilizer has to be delivered via pipes. When different types of fertilizer are delivered, their properties will be proportionally mixed. Okay, interesting. Apply the green. That's got to be this guy. Okay, soil fertility affects the crop yield. 60% fertility will get you 60% yield. Most crops consume fertility by growing, and fertility replenishes naturally whenever it's below 100%. Or it can be increased by growing crops that provide fertility or by using fertilizers. Growing the same crops after each other increases their fertility consumption. Thus, it's advantageous to rotate different crops, which we're doing, right? So we're saying target 80%. What is all this? Maximum fertilization target achievable with the currently stored fertilizer. Yeah, because we got a full tank. That's going to change. What about if we target these all at 100% to start with? We'll check back in and just see what that does. If we start draining our fertilizer tank or what. Right, right now they're loaded. And this is pretty potent fertilizer, right? It's level two. Um, I'm not sure how our, I guess our fertilizer one. Yeah, I'm not sure if this production is going to be stifled by the amount of ammonia that we're producing over here. This guy is producing nine every 60, right? Nine every 60. And this one wants 12 every 60. So we're going to get less than 30 fertilizer every 60. This is going to get less than 30. But things will slow down. But it looks like it's kicking it out pretty fast, right? I'm not sure how fast three farms use it. 
We'll see. Maybe that's uh, going to be more beneficial than I was actually thinking. I like it. I like it. Let's do a quick check on Unity. Our cap is at 152. Um, limestone crew has no available designations. That's not good. Let's fix that, and then we'll call it an episode. These guys can keep... Mm, yeah. Tell you what, let's do that next episode. These guys are trucking that limestone pretty far. Let's give them another storage container, and let's start thinking about how we might want to fill in this area and get a proper limestone mine where we got to dig underground. There's tons of limestone on the map. I don't think we're going to run out. In fact, I think, do we have a deposit of limestone? No, we've got coal if we need it. Like sulfur quartz, which I think we're going to need to bring in for glass production, maybe. Not sure. Um, yeah, no limestone yet. We may uncover that later. But yeah, let's leave it here. And then uh, when we get back next episode... We'll continue to monitor the water situation, particularly with this set of storage arrays. We'd love to see that get filled up. Um, but maybe next episode we focus on the limestone situation. And hopefully these guys are putting their dirt here, not trucking it across the island, these terraformers. But yeah, we'll give everything a once-over, copper miners and stuff. We'll check it all out beginning of next episode. But for now, that's it for this one. It's GladderCat saying thanks so much for watching. Special thanks to GladderCat patrons and channel members. Your support is deeply appreciated. If anybody else would like to help support the channel, I've only got a barely a little more than a handful of supporters at this point. Could really use the support. There's links to support the channel in the description of this video and every video, or you can just hit that thanks button. You can make a one-time donation. That would be greatly appreciated. Uh, and with that, I'll see you all in the next episode.